everyone and welcome back to my channel. This is Norma. Today's project is another project for the Sweet Haunting class and this is going to be a very simple one and um, you can use candy, you can use M&Ms, you can use anything like that. Uh, for, for today's project since uh, I've showed you that you can use candy and there's a lot of schools that don't accept candies um, or or any kind of treats in the classroom. So I'm gonna do a pencil instead. So again, in your kit, you're gonna have um, everything you, that you need to complete this project. And so to get started, we're gonna go ahead and insert our pencil in here, like so. And these fit pencils perfectly. So, and then these, the great thing about these um, one by eight Cello bags is that they come with adhesive already and all you do is you remove that little strip and glue that together and that glues nicely there. So what I'll do is I'll put, um, I'll leave that so you can see that. So I'll put that aside for now. Let's go ahead and get our stamping done. And again, for this particular project, if you ordered the punch, of course, you're going to get your two pieces to punch your uh, tag. Um, otherwise, you'll get, um, otherwise, if you just purchase the stamp, you'll get um, one in basic black and one in very... Okay, so we're going to go ahead and stamp our image. And I'm going to go ahead and use a pumpkin pie for that. And uh, is it pumpkin pie? Darn it. You know what? I'm sorry. Uh, we are actually using basic black for that. Okay, so let me make sure my stamp is clean. Okay, so again, basic black, because what we're going to do is we're going to go in there and do the coloring. Okay, so go ahead and stamp. Okay, see how that didn't stamp very well. Okay, well, no worries, because that is why we have the other side. So make sure it's inked correctly, and we'll go ahead and stamp again. Okay, make sure press. There we go, much better. Okay, we'll put that aside, close that. And um, actually, before I punch, or no, let's go ahead and punch. You can either color before you punch, or you can punch it. Um, actually, you know what? Let's go ahead and color it. It might be easier to go ahead and color that. And so, again, we're going to go ahead and use pumpkin pie, mar uh, the pumpkin pie marker to do some of the coloring like you see there. Okay. Okay, so now that I'm done coloring here, um, I'm going to go ahead and punch it. And I went on ahead and re-stamped it and colored it only because I didn't like the other one. Little trick is to put a post-it there if it's too short. And then punch it. There we go. So that's done. And then so now um, we also need a black one. So we're going to go ahead and punch one of those out. Okay, and we are ready to assemble this. And so you're gonna go ahead and take your, um, your here, and what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna staple this one here. Take your little stapler and staple it. Okay, like so, and that's how that's gonna adhere. And then you're gonna wanna put this on top, like so. And either you can go ahead and staple that as well, or you can add some glue dots. I'm going to go ahead and add some glue dots. So we'll go ahead and do that. We'll add a few here, and we'll add one to each corner. And then we're pretty much done with this project. And so let me make sure... And there you go. And then you also get some cording, gold cording, and it doesn't come assembled like this. But because I have such a hard time with bows, I went off and did it off camera. And all you do is add your little bow to the top there like so. And there you go. You have a nice little treat with a pencil or with a pencil instead of candy and that is if you can't pass them out in your kids classroom so 
That is project three for the sweet haunting class and I hope you enjoyed this video. Quick little video on these treats. You can again use them for any other um, treats such as M&Ms like I mentioned earlier. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching and stay tuned for video four on the sweet haunting class. Okay, talk to you guys soon.